This tutorial is about the firmware update tool of the EPOS Studio. It shows the recommended procedure to update the firmware of the EPOS 4 positioning controllers. The firmware is the internal operating system that determines the functionality of an EPOS 4 device. As part of an ongoing improvement process, the firmware is subject to continuous development and therefore it is updated on a regular basis. For the firmware update, Connect the EPOS 4 positioning controller to the power supply and to your computer via USB. If necessary, download the latest firmware to your computer from the Maxon Motor website maxonmotor.com. Click on the Firmware Update button in the Wizards window to start the Firmware Update tool. Important! The Firmware Update is a critical procedure. Do not interrupt. Confirm that you have read the warning by ticking the checkbox. Press Next. Select the options for firmware update mode and parameter update mode. Update with the latest registered firmware. The controller will be updated with the latest firmware that is installed on your computer. Place the cursor on the blue info icon to check the latest firmware version. Select Firmware. You can select the firmware from versions that are installed on your computer. Select the desired parameter update mode. Default parameters. The default parameters, it is the original factory settings, will be transmitted to the controller. Thereby, the actually saved controller parameters will be overwritten and will be lost. Keep actual parameters. During the firmware update, the actually saved parameters on the EPOS 4 controller will remain unchanged. Choose this option if your EPOS 4 controller is already parametrized correctly to your needs. Press Next. Select here the desired firmware version. The left column displays the actually installed firmware version of the controller. In the right column you can select the desired firmware from the valid versions that are currently installed on your computer. If you want to see information on the selected firmware version, you can press the button README to see the firmware version document. If the desired firmware version should not be displayed, press the button Browse Firmware. You can select the firmware from the valid versions that are currently installed on your computer. Press Next. Pressing the Start button launches the firmware update. Important. The firmware update is a critical procedure. Do not interrupt while in progress. In case of interrupted update procedure, remember the warning and proceed as follows. First, unplug the USB cable from the controller and reconnect it afterwards again. Then, restart the firmware update wizard. And finally, resume the wizard. The firmware update protocol will be recorded automatically. Once the firmware update is completed, press Finish. All windows are closed. For checking the firmware version, proceed as follows. Click on the communication button to open the communication navigation pane. Right click on the EPOS 4 Node 1 device, select Properties and choose the version tab to see the installed firmware. Press OK. And now the EPOS 4 is ready to be used with the selected firmware. 